don't know, maybe. It's like, what? Like, like, um, like, jet, like methane or carbon dioxide, um, or just hydrogen, I suppose. Helium, obviously laughing gas. Well, where's the line? Because Ian talks a lot about, like, elements and science and, you know, a lot of different forms of matter. Where is the... I know there is no line, but you have energy and you have natural elements of the Earth and other in you know, the universe. Where, where does the wave and particle... There's a hazy area in between the difference of them because they're the same. Yes. Yes. Yes, they are the same. And they are on this planet. This is the Earth plane. And we... Oh. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> um... Well, I, I, I feel like the, 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 the bosons, or the whatever the, the subatomic particles, it depends on what direction they spin. Uh, one direction they become a positive charge, the other direction they become negative. And the positive ones, obviously, then what we think of as conventional mass. And it's like you can change the spin at will. There's like a perceptual resistance to it, but it's that you're able to like just disperse energy. Yes, your perception is energy. So do waves travel? For example, science. So are you saying many scientists ha forget that they're a part of the experiment? Yes. Yes. Right. But some scientists are, are waking up. Yeah, they are. <laughs> We're waking up. We are. We're, are. How do you define a scientist? Is everybody a scientist? Because everybody is every label. Because yes. we're, we're not singular, we're not roles. That's like right. you were saying. So we are everything. Or we're a part of everything. Part of everything. Right. And I think that's where people maybe, there's a clash because some people try to say, you know, we, 
we are we're a part of it and if we say we are it that's like a little bit too much but we we are it but we're a part of it too Well, it's not too much, but I think that... <laughs> I don't think so. No, I'm, it, it's okay, but I think that, like, you know, like, when you, when you heard me say, like, yes, we're a part of it. Because, like, we want to acknowledge that we're, you know, we're not the whole thing. Because there's so much more than we even know. Right, because our bo our bodies, these bodies may not know everything, but the this, we, this, yeah, this. right. But this, but this, yeah, this subjectively, subjectively knows everything. Sometimes it's interesting to just breathe and experience people around the world on the internet just almost silently. I, th at, you know, I don't know how much time we have, but I'd like to just do a, you know, maybe a couple minutes just of breathing before we hang up. Okay, I think we have to breathe, and then we'll have some music. Yeah, y Ian can play a song. What time do you want to, uh, shoot? It's, uh, we've got about 15 minutes left. Okay. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Don't call me up for supper. Okay. But I don't think that I that I'm sitting here with you. <laughs> I'm here. We are here. You, it's funny that you called me today because actually somebody sent me a message asking they were just asking me a question, you know, what is a good introduction to meditation book? And I thought, you know, oh, I don't know. You don't need a book to meditate, but I said be here now. And and I hadn't heard I hadn't, you know, we we hadn't talked in like a year, and I just think that that's I, I love synchronicities. I love when there's just connections that pop up. So, so you thought of me and I just had to call you. <laughs> you, don't you, you just, your thoughts are very powerful. So like a, so are yours. So are yours. My question is, what's the difference between a clear mind and a full mind? Well, the difference between a clear mind and a full mind is it full mind, full mind is like the ocean of the things that the fish and the tails and the, the there's such and so much so much in a full mind. Fears and stuff like that. 
So, you get like full mind, you're not able to see with your eyes. Or it becomes more difficult. And is, is, will distract you. So, like, for. That's because everyone teaches this mindfulness, and I feel like the fullness. There is a fullness in emptiness. There is a wide open expanse of never ending expansion that rips you apart. And it doesn't do that because it's nothing. It does that because it's infinitely dense vacuum or megalopolis. That's right. That's, that's the, this. Oh. Yeah. Goes inside of you. Is it? Yes. Awareness. Awareness. So, like, you clear your field and the density of space goes within and expands? And go down into, down into, uh, awareness, which has at this moment. You are aware. You're aware of this and that. You're aware of me. You're aware of your body. You're aware of, da, 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 da. You're aware of your mind. You're aware of the, the, the awareness is, 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 their plane of consciousness. You can't, you can't, like for example, if you want to find your awareness, a surgeon doesn't go, I found it, I found your soul. It's not a, it's not a thing. Right, it's not a thing, but it's everything. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> oh, it's a pattern of, of mo a, a movement. It's just uh, your soul is a pattern of movement. Right, it doesn't it, it doesn't have a pattern, but it also oh, does have sense. patterns. So it's like awareness is experiencing order and chaos. Yes. Experience is 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 something to to th think about and not think about. But it's <laughs> I feel like I always have to say the other polarity, like, it, it satisfies my soul to speak in ways that encompass the everything and nothing, and if I say something, I want to say the other thing, and it's like, here and there, it's just, you know, mo so much conversation is just one side. So, Conversate. It, it's, it, I'm in the word business. <laughs> I'm a lecturer, I'm a writer, and stuff like that. Yeah. I can't, I can't find the words to, to the awareness. To, I can't describe it. <laughs> it's, a, it's spiraling ecstasy. Yeah. It's like, what is awareness but a 360? It, it bypasses degrees of nature. You're seeing more than 360. Uh, it's like you're going into it and around it and through it. Uh, and, and uh, you know, like, 
and you're seeing it from every perspective as you go around it. Yes, 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 yes. And, and it's like you're, you're just a, a beam of light that is perceiving in every direction outward and a sphere perceiving every direction inward. Love, yeah. I love how, you know, in, you know, the song Strawberry Fields? That's a great one. And how, you know, it talks about nothing is real, but then, you know, everything is real. Like, Philip K. Dick had a great idea that was saying, you know, everything you ever thought is true. So that's like every thought we ever had, every imagination is all in existence somewhere. It is reality somewhere. And at the same time, so, you know, we just love to play going back and forth between, you know, jazzing on ideas of illusion and then idea, reality and illusion are kind of like a coil, like each is one side of the coil. Yep. Yes. 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 Can we play you some things on the guitar? Sure. Here, I'll, let me do a quick one and then you can. I love to play with harmonics. Remember that one? Yes, I certainly. <laughs> fucking good song. Eh? I play this song, but I haven't. I haven't really written anything, any words for it.
Yeah. Okay, I'll play. All right, one more, one more. Your turn. This is called We Will Live On. Okay. And we will live on the other side of time. We will live on the other side of our minds And there are people standing here All composed of light We alive are the side of time we live on we will not die there are people standing here all composed of light That's true. <laughs> so true. Do you like to play? What, what, what instruments do you like to play, Ramdas? Cello. Oh. Do you have one? I can't because I have stroke. Oh. Oh, right. <laughs> but. We are always, our bodies are instruments, even if we have trouble moving them. But the stroke is, is wonderful. It's wonderful because it keeps me from outdoors. It keeps me from golf and sports cars and the cello, and all things. And, and when I got, want to go into love or just go inside, go inside, and the stroke has just helped me to concentrate inside. I, I, I loved I loved fierce grace and I wanted to ask you a question about it you in you said that when you had when you were stroked that it was alarming for you because you didn't experience what you thought you would experience that that it, it didn't seem like it, it, correct me if I'm wrong but it seemed like you said that you didn't feel like you saw a light. You didn't feel like you were going into some other world. What, what did you feel like? No, it was, it was before the stroke. I had a grace life. Grace life. My guru has graced me. And the stroke, I said, where the hell is the grace? And all the, all the people around me were, oh, that poor guy, great. Poor guy has stroke. He laughed, and he 
said, it's grace. And I couldn't understand why, why this grace. And it dawned on me. It's been a graceful, graceful happening. And what what happened to me was depression after the after the stroke because I. I lost my faith. I lost my faith. And you, when you're losing your faith, that's bad. That's bad. That's really bad. I mean, you can believe up, up, up here. Right. Like I faith this this universe is love. The universe is is the one. When did you find faith again after the stroke? How could you say that? Isn't the mind like a bridge between the body and consciousness? Because the mind can be, it can get in our way, but it can also lead us to consciousness. I, th I like to think of it as a bridge between the the yes it is it is bridge it is a bridge it is a bridge it's a bridge be, be, be with, between uh, infinite love infinite power and this the we this right so like with the way you configure your mind, either you're bringing uh, love and consciousness into your body, or you can block it out. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 Right. Wow. 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 That was beautiful. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yes. You guys are your consciousness. Wow. 
Well, we love talking to you, and I'd, I'd love to um, keep making contact, and w I'd love to make some more contributions to, you know, love, serve, remember, and, and we'll, we'll keep, keep communicating. Much love. Much love. See me. Peace and love.